All right, continuing on the test of tower. I got another day off, so I'm going to town on this welding. So I'm just about to uh, torch this thing up and uh, cut this. I'll bring you over to the tower, show you what we got going. I was doing the welding earlier. So from yesterday, you just saw I ran the primary beads. I built did the build up beads, and then I welded everything in the back side. Put some beefy stuff in there. Did the same thing on the far side here too. So everything's pretty much. Well, in place, I sprayed it with the galvanized zinc coating. Now I'm getting my support. So that one arm is going to go from the bottom here, where you can see where the other one was from there. Come up, meet that, push against the beam, and I'm going to weld that in place after I get this thing all set up and rigged. So that's where I'm at right now. I already did this. The heck, I did it with the dam. I must have scraped that on the ground. So anyway, got all that done up there. I'm going to hit this on there. So uh that's it i got a gopro thing going right now S still things and again this is came out nice i'm actually pleased with actually how this thing actually spins so i can't wait to run the test on it again that's just a hand spin it's going slower than what it looks like in a film though but uh it's nice it's free there's no binding no cogging from the generator so that's it hopefully this thing works and my anerometer is right there on the pole just got that from Amazon a few days ago. Very easy to set up. I actually had my kids set it up while I was away. Uh, and it remotes inside the house to the pad, no problem. So that's going to go on a pole that's going to be sticking off of this thing, off the tower. So I'm actually going to try, you guys can give me suggestions, but I'm going to, uh, this is the north side. So all the winds come from the east, southeast, and everything is southwest from here. But I'm going to put the aluminum bar, attach it to here, attach it to here have it come out, I don't know, I'm trying to think of things, come out this way, off it, so it's gonna come from one to this, to around here, outside this, outside the turbine's diameter, and then go 90 degrees straight up, and then sit, you know, whatever, foot above this thing. So the only thing that this thing's gonna have in its way is the actual uh, little pole. So I saw that people put it down lower, but if you put it down lower, it's blocked by all that sort of wind, so you're not getting a pure wind. So I'm going to go with the pole sticking up above that, offset it, and I got aluminum stick rod, so I'll show you some stick welding with aluminum that I've been watching and trying to pick up on. So that's it for now, and I'll update you later.